Saya harap Menteri Dalam Negeri Datuk Sri Dr. Ahmad Zahir Hamidi Boleh Datuk Sri Dr. Zahir Hamidi Boleh menjelaskan perkara ini Kerana surat ini disebarkan luas Sehingga ada orang asing tanya sama saya Adakah surat yang di Tidakkah ini benar atau tidak Lebih-lebih lagi bila mereka lihat laporan Yang dikeluarkan oleh uh, Surat khabar asing Tentang perkara tersebut Adakah ini surat seperti ini Benar Saya tak berani cakap Tetapi saya lihat tentang Maklumat yang dicatat dalam surat ini Sama seperti apa yang dilakukan Dalam surat khabar Semua pun kita ada Was-was kerana Bahasanya tidak Begitu Bertaraf antara bangsa Dan bila kita Lihat tariknya pun bukan Dalam bahasa Inggeris Tapi dalam bahasa Malaysia dan surat ini Kepada Amerika Syarikat adalah Dalam bahasa Inggeris dan bila kita Lihat isi kandungan yang di Nantikan Bahasa ni yang dalam bahasa English uh, Bukanlah Bertaraf antara bangsa I mean What we want to say that if it comes from the Ministry of Home Affairs or FBI It is not The standard Expected Of a letter By the government of Malaysia To the United States government We expect a higher standard than this So We may we have some doubts lah about the veracity of this chapter, but this is now widely disputed. So I hope that the Minister of Home Affairs can come out and clarify whether this letter is genuine. Or not. If it's genuine, of course, then he has to explain why this is happening. And then secondly, can we get a better person to draft better size? Quite a bit embarrassing. Lah. This is our standard that is demonstrated. So I have doubts whether this letter is genuine or not. And what as I said, uh, the, la the, the, the language used and also the uh, uh, even the date, you know, is in uh, Bahasa, but because it corresponds exactly to what is reported in the media. So I've been asked by Florence whether this letter is genuine because they are very concerned. They say, how can the Minister of Home Affairs get involved with gamblers and Gambling kingpins lah. That is they're asking. Is it? Is this how our ministers operate? Is this the company our minister mix around with? Is this the type of company our minister of home affairs mixes around with? And he is supposed to be one of the candidates for a deputy prime minister. So is this the type of company that? Our government minister mixes around with. I think these are serious concerns, and it also affects the not only the integrity but also the image of the Malaysian government. I hope that Dr. Sri uh, Ahmad Zahi Hamidi comes and clarify. I do not want to cast any aspersions yet. I think we should give him the opportunity to explain. Okay. Any questions on this? Uh, you have seen this letter around, isn't it? You have seen this letter, huh? Sorry. You haven't? Ah, you have this letter has been distributed in the web and it's quite widely. So you're just wondering. But what, what is unusual is that it's. Uh, I mean, the language is really. Uh, I mean, atrocious. Uh, for government of Malaysia, for maybe secondary school, okay. Uh, but for government of Malaysia, it's a atrocious standard. And, uh, I, and secondly, of course. Uh, That's why I have my doubts, uh, but if you can't clarify this is not true, especially when uh, the foreign media have reported that he has actually written to the FBI to vouch for Mr. Paul Kwa. Mr. Paul Kwa, yes. Now, that one is a separate matter. I just want to ask him to clarify on that. And I do not want to launch any attacks yet or make any remarks yet because I think we want to give him the opportunity to explain himself and his right of reply. And hope that this matter will not be covered up. Saya harap bahawa perkara ini tidak akan ditutup. Saya tahu bahawa surat khabar seperti 
NSD lah dan sebagainya tidak menyiarkan, menyiarkan perkara ini. I think that they should, they should come out. Okay, thank you very much. That's all.